Good show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Stephen A. Smith. How can how can somebody be so articulate? Intelli- he's intelligent. He's a very intelligent man. He's very articulate. But he explains himself very well. His points, his arguments are always sound. Why so well, much? Not always sound. Well, for the most part, they're sound. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Every now and then, I mean, no one's perfect, right? Everybody's going to have a flawed argument from time to time. But for, uh, for the most part, I think he, you know, he's a sound, logic, objective individual. And, until he come up uh, against politics. Until he starts talking politics. Yeah. It's like, man, you that smart. Why do you... Why do you do an about face when it comes to politics? Because he's got a... He's, he does oh, work. I know why. He's a black public figure on a liberal network. Liberals run everything in Hollywood. That's if you say the wrong people. thing, your career's over. You be but a lot of his fan base is black, and black people are not over like 95% of the public. They will rust him 24-7. Yeah, black people, is, I would say, is the dumbest voting so black he, in America. Uh, Steve not, Stephen A. Smith's not like... He's the typical black guy. Like, me and you, we black. We don't give a shit what black people think. Yeah, I don't care. No, I don't care about them niggas. I stay objective 24-7. You know what's crazy? The way he's... The, this video we about to show you, the way he's spinning it, he's trying to protect himself. He's trying to protect his career, you know? Well, he just he's, he does, things. he's just not bluntly saying these things. He's giving a different um, point of view, a perspective, a rational, objective perspective that everybody should be uh, talking about, but nobody is because they're stupid and liberal. Yeah, and they're afraid to say it. Yeah. Let's go to the video. I told y'all before. I am no Republican. Yeah. I voted for one Republican in my life. That's Governor Chris Christie in New Jersey because I thought that Corzine was a disaster. Pause it. Pause it. <laughs> I voted. You voted for one Republican. <laughs> it was who? Because you thought the other guy was a disaster? All these damn Democrats are disasters. <laughs> Chicago. You, you elect. You vote for the one uh, Republican that's a disaster. <laughs> you, are you actually giving Republicans a first shot? You're not giving them the benefit of doubt. You're giving these Democrats the benefit of doubt. Yeah. 24-7, uh, every year, every election. Yeah, because he's black. Their allegiance is to Democrats. Yeah, they have a strong loyalty to Democrats. Yeah. It's Keep almost it. like it's almost like a cult. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you threw that in because that's what they said about us. That's Trump's what they support. say about us. Yeah, we're in a cult. We're a cult. Just because we believe in the Constitution. <laughs> Keep it going. I voted for Clinton. I voted for Al Gore. Me too. I was stupid. I voted for Barack Obama twice. Me one time. You just I voted dumb. for Biden, despite the crime bill that incarcerated a whole bunch of people in the 90s. Pause that it. looked like me. Pause it. Pause it. And you still voted for that Negro. <laughs> and you still voted. And you know that. <laughs> That's why? why I say blacks are part of a cult, the Democrat cult, man. They cannot vote for the other side if they think they're less black or less than. Yeah, it's like been, they're a sellout or something. It's, no, it's, they have uh, been indoctrinated. They've been conditioned to think this way. Hey, hey, Steve, man, you, you point out all these facts. You wouldn't have voted for Trump if he had a history of doing that. Yeah, so why are you going to vote for Joe Biden? Because he's Democrat. Because you're stupid. You're not ignorant. Well... You're very smart. You're not stupid. Well, stupid and ignorant yeah, is the same yeah. thing. You're well, not, no, ignorant is just like stupid is you don't. Hold on, let me finish. No, no, no. Stupid no. is you can't. You don't have the capacity. Right. He has to. Capacity. Ignorant is. Yeah. He's ignorant. Yeah. Or he's being willfully ignorant and he just doesn't want to. Exactly. That's what I was gonna say before, you, before you stole my thunder. You being willfully ignorant of the issues. I just keep going. And you acknowledge that. Who are you voting for this time? Who you voting for? You gonna vote for Biden or Trump? I know who you voting for. You voting for Biden. Let's keep this going. <laughs> I shoved all of that aside. No, you didn't. You all voted of it. For because I knew how divisive Trump would be. What? But as we sit here now and we watch something like this transpire where there seems to be more rapt attention being paid to folks who are not even here illegal, illegally, nor are from this country, yet we want to turn around and ignore us. <laughs> Black Pause. folks, Latinos. Nobody ignoring y'all? Because y'all ain't about shit. 
That's why. Even though y'all very loyal to Democrats, yeah. y'all voted a 90% clip for uh, Democrats, y'all lazy as shit. Y'all, they don't, y'all don't really go out and vote like you should, yeah. right? They you know, and, and another reason, another thing, y'all not the number two in this country no more. You used to be white, black. And uh, anybody else? Guess who's number two now? Yeah, <laughs> you got it, huh, nigga? It's the Mexicans. <laughs> Those Latinos. Those who, Guatemalans. Yeah. The Latinos, they number two now. Yeah. Y'all ain't, you think black people are not that important. You're important. You can sway the election. If y'all just went 80 20 for Democrats instead of 19, it'd be a landslide election for Republicans. But they ain't doing that. You know what? Uh, every time I hear when they uh, talk about Trump, they always use the same words divisive. Yeah. Who's not divisive and, and is in politics? You either agree with them or you don't. Everything, not everybody's not going to agree with you. So when you keep saying Trump is divisive, and you, and and Biden is not divisive, yeah, that dude's divisive. I mean, how's Trump divisive and Biden's not divisive? Oh, he's a Democrat. That's why. Oh, that's right. You're getting benefit yeah. of doubt. Yeah. You don't give that same benefit of, of the doubt to the Republican Party. Let's, let's keep this going. And beyond, who are impoverished and are in need, we know why you're doing it. Because you want that voting block. Wow. So once again, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> what did I say years ago when I used to give speeches and say, I wish for at least one election, everybody vote, every black person in America votes Republican. Remember when I used to say that? You know why I used to say it? Because you'd have to flatter us from that point forward. You couldn't just take the black vote for granted. You'd have to show us what you're bringing for us, what you're delivering to the table. And oh, by the way, it's not just addressing recidivism in the prison system. We need more than that. We deserve more than that. No, you don't. And we certainly don't deserve to be ignored because others who are in this country are being given stuff that's never given to us. I wouldn't give it to you either. Sorry. Everybody. I'm talking about my black and Latino brothers and sisters. Well, Latinos getting ass. Come on, y'all. They getting ass. What you talking about? Come on. Hey, hey, come on, man. So you said, come on. So who are you voting for? So you say the quiet part out loud. Yeah. While Democrats are placating to illegals. Hey, hey. hold on. Hey, no, oh, hold on. Hey, but Tucker Carlson says. <laughs> Tucker Carlson says that. Oh, we say this shit on Fox or any Republican say, yeah. Oh, that's a white supremacist conspiracy theory. Yeah. Now you got a black liberal saying it. That's exactly why they let them into the country. Exactly why. Yeah, the goal is to make them voters. Yeah. Then black people look this way. Y'all ain't got to vote no more. Those Latinos going to vote Democrat 100%. Then this country's really screwed. Yeah, the dumbest voting block in America. I think, I don't know. It's, it's up in the area. Women and blacks. Kevin, it ain't even close. It's not even a photo finish. Negroes won that race by 10 <laughs> seconds. In a 10-meter dash, they win by 10 seconds. That's how 10-meter dash. 10-meter <laughs> dash. They still win it by 10 <laughs> seconds. That's how, that's how overwhelmingly dumb the black vote is. Yeah, y'all. It's not even close. Y'all stupid, man. Well, that's too Won't hard you to put work. the mic up to your dad? You like your y'all stupid, man. <laughs> <laughs> you call somebody stupid damn mic over here. <laughs> oh, you're not stupid. You just been willfully ignorant. No, nah, they're not stupid. They're biased. They think the other side is How racist. How can you scam. be biased if you're black <clears throat> and you vote for Democrats? Well, they've been indoctrinated. They've been conditioned. They think the other side's right. That's that's why I voted for Al Gore. That's why I voted for uh, Kerry when I was in my early twenties. Yeah, that's why we voted for Obama. But after Obama, I changed my whole outlook on you politics. You start looking at the other side. You voted for Obama twice, and then you wouldn't vote for Biden. Yeah, that's the, that's just. And I know you. I know you. I know you voted for Hillary. I know you did. You a damn. You got to be a vegetable to do that. Yeah. I'm tired of you. Hey, we got a new giveaway going. Give I'm away. tired of these niggas too. <laughs> I'm give, we giving away a Ford F-250 and 10000 in cash. The end of the win. 
Go to officialhawkstwins.com. Anything you buy from the site, get you automatically in a win.